I'm George Groves. You're watching TalkSport magazine, the undefeated, undisputed champion of the web. I'm always looking for the stoppage, and, and but you've got to do it calmly and, and correctly. And if it comes, it comes. He's only been beaten by unbeaten prospects and unbeaten pros. If, uh, if he's as good as he is on paper, I'm in for a test. I have so many sort of superstitious things that, uh, that I do. And I try and break the habit of each one each time I box, but it never happens because there's always something in the back of my mind. Uh, you know, it can be risky, so uh, for instance, um, if I see a, a safety pin that day, it has to go on the shorts, like, and it stays on the shorts, I've literally got thousands of them uh, strapped to a pin underneath the shorts. That's something that's stuck that I've had probably since I was 13, 14, so I've got quite a collection now, as you can imagine. It's a genuine rivalry, I genuinely would love to knock him out, put it that way. He's probably the only the only fighter in Britain that I could say, truly say that about. Um, you know, he talks he talks a lot of nonsense, and, and a lot of people have asked me to knock him out. So I I owe it to the fans to to do that for them. It better happen one day. It's tough sparring in Germany. You don't really want to go on your own, so you want to have someone there to back you up. You know what I mean? Because. Uh, it can get pretty heated. I've heard some, some sort of gruesome stories. A few of the heavyweights that have been over to spar uh, with some of the, the, the German-based fighters, Chagayev and that, they feel like, they're like lambs to the slaughter, basically, you know, they're in and out. So, uh, you know, until, I'm, until I can hold my own, you know, unless, unless it's over here, I don't really want to be over there on my own with people trying to take liberties with me. You know, you're sparring with a world-class puncher and if you switch off you know and you make mistakes that you're gonna get punished that's what happened you know he caught me with a good shot I got straight back up you know and it gave it just as good as I got and then two days later he invited me back so obviously he was happy with what he got I know that Cole can punch so instead of getting in the ring and trying to run away and avoid his punches I'm gonna try and get close to him you know work on my defenses and you know be as tight and compact as possible I love comedy, actually. I love comedy. I love stand-up comedy. I try and get to as many you know, gigs as I can. Um, scheduled to see Frankie Boyle soon. Uh, that's going to be uh, that's going to be one to remember. He's one of my favourite guys at the moment. The day they, the day they sort of really won the title when they beat Man United. Uh, that was the day I won the Commonwealth. So we actually got, I got to go down and with David we were on the pitch, sort of said hello to everyone and that. I see him all in the in the, the tunnel going out. It was quite surreal. I was sort of half shall I say hello, but I didn't want to bother any of them. Like obviously they was all in the zone ready for the big match. But uh, said hello to Alex Ferguson, even though I really didn't want to at the time. That drug was the man. I don't understand why people don't like Drogba. Risa, I'd say, is, was the most annoying player because he was useless, but only played well against Chelsea. <laughs> and uh, I've been. Because he's ginger, people say he looks like me too, though, and that, that I find that quite insulting. Probably sing either Celine Dion, I Will Always Love You, or uh, Michael Jackson, Pretty Young Thing. I'm pretty good at that one. Isn't it? I'd, I'd go with the elite boxing ring girls, to be fair. You do see some ropey ring girls on these low, lower card, no, low budget shows, and that's what evens it up, but then again, you know, all wags seem to look the same, whereas ring girls sort of can bring that, that something special sometimes. Exactly, yeah, hopefully. They were pretty they were pretty they were pretty alright the last time I was out there, so I'm looking forward to that too.